Uh, so just before we start house tour, you know, I'm sure some of you may have uh, heard of him or seen Toby before, but this is uh, Toby, the star of the new film, A Goofier Movie. Um, I'm just going to put him away in the kitchen, because we're not going to go in the kitchen, and um, get himself a bit worked up if we're going around the house with a stranger. So just going to tuck him in here for one second. On with the living room. Um, as you can see, it's quite a spacious room. It's one of the bigger ones in the house. Um, as with a lot of the house, other than the uh, kitchen and hallway that you've already seen, um, it's grey carpet primarily. I've gone with a grey scheme, colour scheme, to sort of match that. So it's not seen too bland. I've mixed in some red as well. Quite happy with the way it looks. So I am thinking of maybe adding a picture right about here, you know, just to really tie the room together. Uh, as you can see, me and the dog spend quite a lot of time in here, me and Toby. He likes to leave his things littered about the house. I did try and tidy it before you came, but uh, there's only so much you can do. Uh, you know, I think I like to spend my evenings in here. I've, uh, I've watched quite a few shows, primarily my favourites being um, Peaky Blinders, which I'm very lucky to have been a part of in the newest season. Um, Another one of my favourites, if you've heard of the hit show Suits, I think it's spectacular really, I really like it. Uh, so me and Toby normally just sort of sit in here, sit under the armchair, sit under the couch, I normally have a cup of tea, biscuit, just sort of unwind from the day it's set. After all, it's quite stressful being an actor, a lot of people sort of underestimate that. Uh, right, I think that's pretty much it for the living room honestly, there's not much going on. Uh, let's go upstairs. So if you follow me, this is the upstairs landing. So we're gonna I'm gonna give you two of mostly all the rooms except for that, which is not a room at all, it's the boiler. And this, which is currently occupied by a good friend and longtime fan of the show, who reached out to me after the release of the movie because he was quite impressed with my performance. Al Pacino. But to be honest, he's a little bit camera shy, so he's asked me to not include him in the video. So We'll continue on with the tour and we'll try to be a bit quiet after all. We want to keep Al Pacino happy. Right, uh, just the first guest there. Gym is going to be fairly quick. It's not really in use. Um, as the other one's quite a bit bigger. You know, Al opted to use the bigger room. Fair enough. Um, a lot of this is actually scrapped from my childhood bedroom after all. I want to sort of not lose touch with where I started. Right. On with the tour. If you'll just follow me, we're gonna look at the main bathroom. That uh, honestly, I spent quite a lot of time unwinding it after some stressful nights on the, the set. I thought quite a lot of it is uh, during the night time, so there's no sense really going out or anything afterwards because everybody's already asleep. So I like to spend some time in here, just chilling out. It's fairly small, compact, but um, you know, it suits its purpose. Right. On to the next room. So, what some of you may not know is that I'm actually a bit of a gamer. I uh, quite like nerdy things, Marvel, DC, and um, I really like playing on my Xbox. I like to spend a lot of my nights off in here. You know, I'll spend time sort of laid back here, talking to friends from school that I haven't spoken to in a while. I don't often get a chance to reach back out to them because of how busy I am all the time. But when I do, it's really nice sit in here and wind down, headset on, playing some games. But um I'll tell you the truth, I've got my bees. Uh, back in the day I used to be quite the guitarist actually. I don't know if you've heard of him, but uh, he's sort of a local legend around here. Sam Fender actually reached out to me to play guitar on a couple of his songs just here and there, which I'm actually really proud of. You know, he's I'm really proud of Sam. I haven't spoken to him in a while but he's he's really grown his fame and his uh, popularity. He's a lovely bloke. Now, the main event. This is uh, my bedroom. You know, uh, you know, lovely, spacious. This is where the magic happens, you know what I mean? And uh, actually, you know, it might be quite cool for you guys to see. You know, I was speaking earlier about being a bit of a nerd. Well, um, Currently I'm playing uh, a game of Castles and Crusades. It's just my uh, character sheet, I'm not sure if you can see it properly. 
Castles and, Castles and Crusade, if you're not aware, is uh, a game similar to Dungeons and Dragons. I'm currently playing a uh, male human druid, which is level two. Uh, oh, over here as well. This is some Lego. I quite like collecting bits just here and there. I've got some more in the garage, but it's uh, currently boxed up right now, so there's no point showing you. Oh, and if you look at this, this is me, a school friend, and a uh, it was honestly lovely meeting Ian. He's a long time hero of mine. Uh, genuine guy. Absolutely superb meeting him. I'd love to do it again. Through there is just my own suite. No point going through there. Just the necessities, you know, toilet, shower, sink, what have you. And um, tell you the truth, other than the kitchen, there's not much left of left the tour. So, um, you know, that's all. It's lovely having you here. Lovely being here. Uh, let's do something like this again there.